Today, we are going to be skipping the Sheikah Slate in Breath of the Wild. I'm going to try and beat the game without using the Sheikah Slate. We're not even going to pick it up. We're going to have to skip all of the runes. We have a little bit of setup to do to be able to skip the Sheikah Slate because it is very technical and there are a lot of glitches. So, uh, yeah, what we need to do is we need to set this up a little bit. We're going to be doing some wrong warps and we need to activate the moon jump glitch both of which i have never done before moon jump if you've never seen it we need to get by i believe getting on the horse starting the archery mini game and just running away and we need to hop on a horse as this timer is running out all right stop the horse now we will just be trying to land on this horse here Like so. And that should be the moon jump glitch, I think. Yeah, we have uh, another horse. And it will freak out a bit. <laughs> because it's confusing the game. Yeah. So, <laughs> we, we have the moon jump glitch and the horse is a little bit pissed that we're pulling out his hair. But it's fine. Now, we can jump as much as we want. <laughs> so this is the moon jump glitch, and we can just jump around as much as we like. Totally normal. He's got mad hops. But now that we have done this, we need to warp back to the medallion. We're in the process of tricking the game into sending me to the wrong location. We're going to return to title screen. And now we're going to play in master mode, which I have never done before, so it should be a new file. Good. Okay, so now we need to save the game. And we need to load this same file that we just... Yeah, we need to load the same file. And this should work, I believe? Y yeah, so... <laughs> so now we're in the shrine. Uh... <laughs> and we need to close the game. Now we need to reopen the game. So that, yeah, that's a wrong warp. And that's necessary. It's a bit <laughs> confusing, but... That's the way it is. So now we don't have that moon jump glitch anymore, but we're still in the shrine. We're in master mode. You can see it on the bottom left. And we'll we'll grab this, because, like, why not, right? Cool, we got barbarian armor. We're going to get the uh, the orb, and then uh, something a bit strange is going to happen again. <laughs> so we got a spirit orb. We will only be able to get four of these for, for reasons that I will show you in a bit. And now... We exit the shrine, but because we have never gotten the paraglider, if the game ever senses we are out of the plateau, something happens. Link collapses. The game loads for a very long time, and then once the loading is done, we are brought back to here. And wait a minute. We don't have the Sheikah Slate. We're outside of the Shrine of Resurrection. Hey, look at our hip, we don't have it. In our inventory, we look at it, we have the armor. We don't have it. So we have skipped the Sheikah Slate already. But, to be able to skip all of the ruins, we need to be able to get off the plateau. And to get off the plateau, we need four spirit orbs. So, we need to do this three more times. My ho Me and my horse are something else? I mean, yeah, we are. <laughs> we kind of are something else, aren't we? <laughs> Paraglide, it's hilarious. Okay. Ooh, what, what the heck? What is going on? We're we're really moving, huh? Yo, Link is going up, dude. Look at him go up, down, up, down, up, down. Okay, okay. We need to load the save in the shrine. There we go. And we're back over here. And we have two orbs now. We also have the armor. Two spirit orbs. We return to the title screen, and we repeat this again. So... We collapse, and the game loads for an eternity. It's freaking out because it doesn't know what to do. Where do we put Link? I don't know. It's, it's like a bunch of people in a room screaming at each other, trying to decide where to put him. Do we put him here? Where do we put him? We, do we put him right back where he fell? Do we put him in the plateau? But when he's in the plateau, it doesn't have the Sheikah Slate. Do we put him back in the very start? But no, that doesn't make any sense, because obviously he managed to get out of there. So, like, <laughs> where do we put him? Yeah, now we're back on the plateau. We have a full, beautiful set of armor. Still, no Sheikah Slate, but three spirit orbs. And then we'll do it again. So now we go to the title screen. 
Yo, this, uh, this horse is a little bit feisty. Look at this boy. It, look at him go. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, <laughs> my horse, you and your horse are something else. You're telling me. Promise me you won't get careless. Oh, <laughs> uh, whoop. <laughs> look at us go. That horse is moving, dude. <laughs> Alright, we should probably do something before, like, the game crashes or something. <laughs> okay, so now we are on the plateau. We have a Royal Claymore, we have the Barbarian Helms in the, the Barbarian set, but most importantly, we have four Spirit Orbs, and we do not have the Sheikah Slate. The reason I got this was twofold. Not being an idiot. So I can jump down here, and we can actually start making progress. I'll show you guys something really quick. Normally, you can press pause to open the map, right? I ignore this half. I'm pressing the pause button. It's not doing anything. I'm pressing the button. We can't open the map. I'm pressing the Sheikah scope button. We can't open it. In the bottom right, we don't have a map. So we can't ever see where we're going. We can't warp anywhere. We don't have even the mini map. And uh, we need to trigger a cutscene really quick, I think, so we can get the uh, old man up in the tower. So we're just gonna jog over to this one. And uh, some stuff is gonna happen. The old man is gonna come over and he's gonna say hello. He's gonna be like, hey, you managed to get your hands on a spirit orb. Well done. Uh, how did he know? We haven't even finished a shrine. Clairvoyance, okay. It's all connected to that Sheikah slate you carry on that hip there. What do you mean? <laughs> Damn that hip. It's been quite some time since I've seen that Sheikah Slate. Yep, they have the kingdom time and time again. Their ancient technology disappeared long ago. Or so it is said. No, it still disappeared. We still don't have it. It survived all that time. I don't know what you're talking about. I actually don't know what you're talking about. There's three more? Three more what? Uh, top of that tower again. Top of that tower? What tower? <laughs> Got it. But allow me to teach you something else before you go. Take a look at your map on the Sheikah Slate. Sure! Hmm. Those blue icons! You should recognize the cave where you woke! Of course! Yes! The blue icons! Yep! All of them! Yeah! <laughs> you can tr instantly travel using the Sheikah Slate! Link is just like, I have no idea what's going on! Just smile and wave! <laughs> That's basically all it is. He's just like, yep, okay. What are you talking about? Oh, but wait, there's more! <laughs> He's giving you a stern talking to himself. <laughs> With this, you have now acquired all of the spirit orbs from the shrines on this plateau. Yep. Do you understand? I don't understand anything! None of this makes sense! And yeah, so like, I'm pressing up on the D-pad right now. You guys can hear that. The- the rune menu isn't popping up. Cause we didn't get any runes. We- we can't use them. But first thing that I'm gonna do is... Uh, I guess we'll just get Stanima. We have the paraglider. We do not have any runes. We do not have a map. We cannot warp. So some, I'll show you something really quick before we grab a horse. Now, since we skipped the Sheikah Slate and we haven't gotten the tower or anything, we we can't do the like we just it won't it won't do it. <laughs> so we just can't get into shrines. Yeah, if you want speed food, talk to Impos of the Dragon Spawn. So I think the first order of business is going to Kakariko. So let's get a horse to go to Kakariko. I think there's horses over this way. We're in. Oh god, get on the horse. Please don't hit me, please don't hit me, please don't hit me. Uh, go! Okay, we got the horse, baby! We're good! <laughs> Alright, so we need to head over to Kakariko, which I believe is in this direction. What is the name gonna be? What do you guys want? I'm seeing a lot of Thick Ant. I think that was the, the winner. Alright, so let's go to Kakariko. Is it this way? Alright, let's see, let's see. This really feels like I'm actually exploring. Examine. Kakariko Hotino. Okay. Kakariko. Let's do it. Who are you? Hmm? Is that a Sheikah Slate? No, it's not. But that would mean you're... No, it's not possible. We don't... 
We don't have a... What, what are they seeing? Uh, I don't know what they saw, but apparently they saw some kind of a Sheikah Slate. I don't know what they're talking about. It's a Sheikah Slate. What are you talking about? <laughs> what is this thing that everyone is talking about? I don't know. Is that a Sheikah Slate in your pants? Or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> what is this Sheikah Slate that everyone's talking about? I lost my memory. I don't know. <laughs> I just walked out of the Shrine of Resurrection without knowing what it was. Does the run have an ending or just for fun? We will be beating Ganon. Hopefully today. I feel like we could do it in, in a day. The device Princess Zelda left you is your guide and also your memory. It's just looking at his crotch. Link's crotch is a device indeed. Mm-mm-mm. Okay. We'll wait for this guy to drop down a little bit. And pick him up. Go. Will I do Divine Beast? You literally can't do Divine Beast. If you don't have a single rune, it's impossible to do the Divine Beasts. Oh yeah, you need the slate to activate the terminals in the beast. There you go. Where are you going? We're going to get uh, a bunch of Jirians, because they're really good to health food. How long do I think it'll take me? I think we'll probably finish this today within uh, the next 20 minutes. Yeah, the reason why I came over to this mountain is because of these trees. These trees here are filled with Jirians. And this is gonna probably be enough food to handle through all the way through all the fights. See, we got enough food, I think. Now we have to go kill a Lionel. Lionel at the Coliseum, right. Does the Lionel at the Coliseum have a bow? It'll have a decent weapon at least? Okay. He does not miss, apparently. Okay. Alright, will I be able to kill him? They never miss. Huh. Alright, we'll just keep smacking him, I guess. Christ, he has a lot of health. My pot lid is badly damaged, we'll look at that. He's recovering health. No! They can't sacrifice himself for me! Did you see that? <laughs> there you go, that should... Okay, he's done. Perfect timing, too. Okay, so we got a good shield, we got a good weapon and stuff. Lionel shield, Lionel horn, got a bunch of electric arrows, shock arrows. All right, Lionel bow, 10 times 3, that's not bad. Lionel sword, that's pretty good. Ice sword in the Colosseum, there isn't an ice sword in the Colosseum because the weapons scale for what you've done. I think we need to make a stop into the castle to get some good weapons. We need to go to, like, lockup or something. We won't be able to get all of these good bows that I want without, uh, without it. Whew. Oh my lord, you guys see that? 15 arrows? I'm pretty sure that was just, like, insane luck. That bow... Great flame blade, that's a good weapon. That's a great bow. That's a great weapon. Yeah, yeah. I can't kill an enemy with one weapon. That is dumb. That's actually dumb. You can't kill a single enemy with one weapon. Alright, now, of course, because we don't have Magnesis, we can't actually make it into the castle from here. Because... We can't... We can't get in. You can cheese these guys with sneak strikes. Oh, I guess you can. You have to come from, like, directly behind for him to not notice you. <laughs> what? That works, I guess, huh? Yeah, was that 20 arrows? 20 shock arrows, let's go! Okay. Is this lockup? Oh, this is lockup. But we don't have any bomb arrows to get in, so I actually can't get into lockup. Because <laughs> we use Cryonis to get into here normally, but we, we don't have Cryonis. I can't get into lockup without bomb arrows. There might be a way in through the side door. We'll see. Alright, so there is this wall that we can glide into. Get into lockup. 
but uh, they were still kind of stuck. Will that opened me up. Oh no, there's this, this. Okay, that does, does open it up. Cool. Uh, hmm, now what's the play here? <laughs> Start a prison gang? Start by picking up a Dragon Ball Moblin Club. Because <laughs> a Hylian Shield would be like a big get, obviously. Cover health so quickly, oh my lord. Okay. Don't you dare! There we go. Okay, that was actually very easy. Great Thunderblade, Royal Halberd, a sword as well. Okay, you know what? Be the Hylian Shield. Ooh, nothing can stop me now, baby. Where is he going? Did he- what? He just went through that wall to- Huh? Don't you dare! Wizard Rod. So we have a bunch of good weapons. I think this is what we will sneak strike stuff with. Oh. Damn it! <laughs> Uh, stuff like this happens? Set it on fire, maybe? Arrows go right through. I think we're stuck. One bomb arrow can do it. You've won this time, Ganon. Huh. Look, guys. The bomb arrow worked. I would have never guessed. You guys are so smart. Okay, so we, we have enough weapons now, obviously. What we need to do is we need to go kill some Lynels for some really, really good bows. So now we just need to make it to a stable so we can get 20 bomb arrows from Rito. Oh, no, there it is. Okay, bomb arrows right here. Five for 200 each. Take them all, all five of them. Yeah, I, got, oh, I mean, what else are we going to spend our money on? What else are we going to spend our money on? We have a bunch of our, our hearty foods, so we'll do all of this. Unfaced hmm. meadow, bomb arrows. Thank you for the bomb arrows. Are you ready? Uh, wait a second. I'm not ready. <laughs> See you, nerd. I'm not helping you out at all. So there's our bomb arrows. We have 51 bomb arrows now. Uh, now we need to go find Lionel. So, does anyone know where the closest strong Lionel is? Probably over the hill? Over this hill. Okay, cool. If we can mount him and just smash him a bunch of times with the Royal Guards Claymore, that will do the trick. Oh, there he is. Okay. Now we save and uh, give him the fight of his life, I guess. Yo. Push this. Mount. Mount. And... <laughs> you see that damage, though? Oh my lord, that did a lot of damage. We're gonna have to try, though. Yeah, I, <laughs> I tried to take on my paraglider to fly above, but it didn't take it out. I need to hit him, like, occasionally just so he doesn't start recharging. Wait a, wait a minute, wait! Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you guys see that? I don't know if you guys saw that. Watch the arrow very closely. This next arrow, watch it. Watch that arrow. He turns the arrow back to me? What is going on? <laughs> That's something you've never seen before? There's always something. Ooh, regular arrow in the chin. Five hits. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, we 
get on him, and then, oh, one, two, three, four, five. Give me a nice little updraft. And we'll run in. And we'll go one, two, three, four, five. That's not his chin. Oh my. Do I reset? Or do I let Thick Ant die? I think we let him die. <laughs> Honestly. We'll, uh, we'll just smack him with this adventure. He's done it. We've done it! Okay! There we go! Our arrows. I lost spear, but this is this is the big one though. This bow. Mighty Lionel bow, that's good. So I imagine in an area this open, there's horses somewhere around. But they can't made a noble sacrifice. North okay, I guess we'll go northeast of Death Mountain. You guys are saying there's a bunch of good ones there? <laughs> oh, something that's kinda cool. Okay, so you know one of the towers how it has a skull on the top? Um, well, because we didn't activate any of the towers, there's just a floating skull where the tower would be. Because the tower is still stuck in the ground. So that's just a floating skull. <laughs> Yo, hey, whoa, 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 new ant, where you think you- New ant, get out of the muck. New ant, get out of the- What are you doing? Alright. New ant, you genius! Good job, new ant. You got rid of him real nice. Okay, now we do need to get around Lost Woods. Just gotta go around the mountain. I, I think this is where uh, new ant is, uh, is gonna have to go bye bye. Oh, 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 papa! Ah, ah! Nope! <laughs> <laughs> no! There he goes. Goodbye, my dad. You lived a good life. Oh, he survived! He's just going for a swim. He's good. He's he was just swimming, all right? All right. He's gonna shuffle to the left, and then he's gonna shuffle to the right. Here we go. What? What? Yeah, this one immediately does the fire attack. Okay, let's try and learn how to parry this. Yeah, I can't mount him, so that doesn't stun him. But parry, then shoot him. That's how it works. Alright. Oh, there we go, good, five hits. One, two, three, four, five. Alright, this backflip strat is working quite well. <laughs> There's a rock. I need a rock to backflip off of. <laughs> oh, I need stamina. No. Pretty sure I need stamina to do this. Oh, the stamina recovered as I was climbing onto him. Let's go. Okay. Let's do this. Alright. This is working. This is working. <laughs> no, no, no. Night night. Night night. Get out of here, dude. Get out. You're dead. You're dead. Woo. Bunch of real good stuff. We got Savage Lionel Bow. That's so good. Yes. And the friggin' Savage Lionel. 78. What? How many more bows do I need? We need two more bows. Here and here. It would be easy. Like, that last one was so easy. Because you just backflip and shoot him. But this one, I like, there's nothing to backflip off of, so it's super hard. Alright, back on. Alright, there we go. One, two. This takes so much focus. This takes so much freaking focus. Oh my god. You can never get a hit in a Lionel fight.
Alright, it's getting close. Maybe one more of those. There you go. Is this it? Is this it? This could be it. Come on. Nope. Okay. Come on. Should be it. Alright. Done. We got him. Alright. There's another one down. Savage Lionel Bow, that is what we like to see, baby! Ooh. Savage Sword, that's nuts! Want a bomb arrow farm? Wait, there's an area you can farm bomb arrows? Only if it's raining? It's never gonna rain because the weather never changes, so we can't. Yeah, let's go! We're going on an adventure! Come with me! Oh, they explode. I just wanted a friend, okay? <laughs> yeah, now we just need to jog to the other line. We'll kill him. We'll have enough bows to kill Ganon. Good. He's dead. He's done. Okay. Wait, what? Ooh, why did he only hit twice? I don't know. But we got him. <laughs> uh, we need to find the closest fairy fountain. Level 1 armor upgrade, whatever we can. We'll grab fairies while we're there. We'll be able to buy some arrows, maybe? So sneak up on these, grab four fairies. Fairies, alright. Please go down a little bit. Thank you. Come here. Come here, little buddy. Take it! There we go, we got it. Okay, examine. Let's open this thing up. Okay, Lionel Horn, we have that? Uh. Yes, please. No, wait! Wait! Okay. Oh, okay, we're good. Oh. Alright, we got one! Register Boy Ant? Okay, okay, I'll register Boy Ant. Boy Ant. I think that's how you spell it. So is this man can float? You're saying I can get five ancient arrows just by climbing up? One for each blight and one on Ganon? I feel like... The hard part, I I believe, is probably just going to be Calamity. Five Ancient Arrows. Let's go. Save them for Calamity. I'm saving them for Calamity. No, without a doubt. Okay, here we go. Wakey, wakey. Time to die. Here we go. I got this. Hopefully I got this. We'll see. The fights begin. Which fight it starts? Windblight. Okay, Boyant couldn't hear my call. It's okay, Boyant. You'll be with me soon, baby. Alright, go, go, go. Go! He woke up fast, oh my lord. What? That is cheap. That is so cheap. He's just warping so he can recover his HP. What a cheater, dude. Just some cheater strats. Some cheater strats! Yeah, yeah, phase two, he makes little things appear. I have no idea what these things actually do, if I'm being completely honest. Go to bed. It's your bedtime. Go to sleep. There we go. One done! Right. And we're spinning. Ah, it's a fairy. Okay, second phase. Okay, so now I think we have to use bomb arrows because of that. I think, because he will suck these in, I believe. Oh, get the suck. Yeah, that drops him to the ground, there we go. Alright. He dead. Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> there we go. Alright, sucks to suck. Yep, it really does, doesn't it? There we go, there we go, that'll work! 
I'm gonna have to drop onto the ground as fast as I possibly can, or jump into the air as fast as I can before he does this, because I want to use bomb arrows on him. What? Jesus Christ. That's not fair. That's not He's healing to full during this. On to the next phase. We still got three fairies. We still got a lot of food. We're good. I. Oh right, right. I forgot. I was like, why can't I use Magnesis? I need to Magnesis him. Damn it! I dealt so much damage. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I actually don't know how I'm supposed to hit him right now. Why did it default to Ancient Arrows? Oh, that's another one! That's another one! Okay. Drop the Highland Chief, but you didn't drop my weapon. Okay. Okay. We don't have any fairies. We have zero fairies now. Good start. Very good start. Okay. Come on. Onto the next phase, good. Good, good, good. Phase two. We're doing it for Boyant. We're doing it for Boyant. He's gonna laser me. Crap. And he's. Re oh, look at his health go up. Look at how fast it goes up. That is not fair. Okay, we're gonna have to bounce this back. Good. Christ. Harry, there we go. We're good. Um, this one. Just going to the wall, he's gonna recover a quarter of his health. Okay, we're gonna have to parry this. There we go. He's gone out down on the ground. Okay, back down to half health. There we go, Ancient Arrows. Oh, they don't do much. They really don't do much. There we go, there we go, baby. Jeez, I gotta parry another one. Christ. Okay. Parried. Good. Good. Parried it. Drop down on the ground. Come on. Come on. Hit me. He's recovering so much HP. Here we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. We're going back in. There we go. He recovers health so fast. He's just been at the same health this whole time. Like I, I've, I haven't been able to reduce his health at all. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good. 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 Good.
I'm getting close. Oh, he's going up to the wall. I feel like so much HP. Come on. Just hit me. Just hit me. Come on. Just try and hit me, please. Stop walking. And he does a super slow attack, so he's recovering most of his HP. My god. Problem. I can't. He's just getting his HP back. Okay, it stopped recovering. Is there a limit to how much he can recover? I think there might be a limit to how much he can recover. There's a regen cap! God, more parries. Ugh, come on. Let's go. Okay. There we go. There we go. Flurry rush that. Another one? Good. Uh, do we have a spinning weapon? We do. Okay, we can still get him in a stun lock. He's going up on the wall, but I don't think he can recover anymore. I think we're good. Oh, he's recovering again! No! Just get on the ground! No recovering! <laughs> Come on! Die! Yes! Okay! Let's go! First try! <laughs> Ooh! Let's go! Now the crotch shot! Get ready for the crotch shot! Here we go! Hit him in the junk! We got him! Boyant! Please! Get out of there, Boyant! Okay! Whew. Come on! Come on! It'd be great if I could hit it. We're done! We beat it! No shake a slate! Just like that! Woo! So that was 23 minutes 59 seconds. Couldn't open up any shrines. Couldn't warp. Couldn't look at a map. Couldn't use bombs. Couldn't use nothing. Yeah, who needs the Sheikah Slate anyways, right? It has been done. It feels good. But thank you for all the support today, you guys. Thanks for watching. It was fun.